All combined, the California fires have destroyed tens of thousands of acres and now destroyed nearly 200 structures, and the conditions expected to get even worse before they improve. Danielle Nottingham tonight has the latest from Los Angeles. Flames and smoke continue to engulf parts of Southern California, hours before the powerful Santa Ana winds picked up. The wind is expected to kick up in some places to 70 miles an hour. That's <laughs> hurricane force winds. This fire just got way bigger. It's now on the freeway. Those winds helped fan a new wildfire Wednesday near the 405 freeway in Los Angeles. As helicopter crews made water drops on hot spots in the area, firefighters on the ground raced to save multi-million dollar homes in Bel Air. I go over here, whole mountain is on fire. Thousands of people were forced to evacuate, leaving much of their possessions behind. With multiple wildfires burning here in Southern California, resources have been stretched thin. Firefighters have requested more assistance as they continue to battle the flames. We have resources coming as far away as Northern California. We may request to our regional partners through surrounding states and the western part of this country. The largest fire in the region is burning in Ventura County, where more than 65,000 acres have burned. The air quality has gotten so bad, Last residents night, there are wearing masks. This, this is uh, it's kind of like nuclear winter, I guess. Fire officials have warned residents throughout Southern California to be ready to evacuate, with weather conditions expected to get even worse. Danielle Nottingham, CBS News, Los Angeles. And like Montana, 2017 is also California's worst fire season on record. We're checking in on our